Are you afraid of the dark? Hey everyone, Evan, welcome back to another episode of Permission to Game, and yes, we are going to talk about something that is actually going to make you afraid of the dark, the median coming out on January 28th, so not too far away if you're looking for a great new game that'll scare the socks off you, we have this one in store. If you are new to the channel, do me a favor, hit that subscribe button below, it'll help us out a lot here, and again, I love seeing your pretty faces, so thanks for joining us. The medium is technically, you could kind of consider it the first exclusive for Microsoft because it's coming out to the Series S and X and PC here on January 28th of 2021. So not too far away. It's going to be an experience and a true test of what the system is capable of. It is definitely pushing more towards the RTX and ray tracing capabilities. So if you've got your setup and your Series X and S ready to go, you're going to love playing this game. And like I said, it's one you're going to want to play with the lights on because just watching the trailers alone scared the living snot out of me. Like it's that good. That's been put together by the Bloober team and is an experiment in the idea of playing in a dual reality as you're kind of moving through the game. Now, this isn't the first time to jump between one piece of the game and another piece of the game. We saw it with Resident Evil. We've seen it with Heavy Rain and other things that have gone on in the past that have been fidelically, I mean, if that's even a word, like really, really good. Now, they took kind of an experiment in the way that we chose to do more of an artistic game. The game itself is very beautiful in the way it's been crafted together. There's a few things when it comes to like human facial features and dynamics that don't quite look right. But overall, the game is really focused on the art style and the music. But be aware, this is a very mature game. Definitely make sure it's appropriate for you and your loved ones. In this game, you're going to discover the dark mystery that only a median can solve. Explore the real world and the spirit world at the exact same time. Use your psychedelic abilities to solve puzzles spanning both worlds. Uncover deeply disturbing secrets and survive encounters with the Ma, an entity born from the unspeakable tragedy. Now, just watching the first 14 minute gameplay trailer that there is available online, like the game itself is very intriguing. Like this alternate universe is, is very reminiscent of what we got with Stranger Things and the other side of their reality as well. Everything's just kind of decaying and falling apart and we can't quite figure out obviously within that first 14 minutes what exactly is going on. But the game is sure to leave you hanging and want to keep you playing more. With the third person style, you're going to be climbing your way through an adventure that only you are there to uncover. There's so many things to interact with. Now it's not a typical over the shoulder uh, third person and kind of view you are camera itself is forced to be fixed in kind of a, a singular track as you're moving through different pieces and different corridors elements will then become available for you to click and discover but only when you get close enough to them and i'm sure you can change the sensitivity so that it either is very apparent to you or not apparent at all until you get really close to it it leaves you the opportunity to explore every element of the game yes you can pre-order the medium now it is available within the microsoft store and online with pc and epic games so definitely check that out if you got a pc this one's going to be beautiful. If you got your Xbox Series X, this one's going to look great. And even on the Series S, honestly, it's going to be capable of both consoles and both machines. You're going to get the most, though, out of the Series X. Is this one that I definitely recommend to pick up? I don't know. Like I said, it's a very limited audience. You have to be into the horror style game. It is a single player kind of adventure game with tons of different puzzles you got to figure out and a creature that kind of haunts you as you're going through it. You got to figure out what happens. So definitely one that you want to, might want to put on your watch list. I would wait and see how the reviews are because there's not a lot out there right now. They've kept it kind of quiet and haven't released a ton of information, but ultimately it looks from all the trailers and previews we have gotten that it's going to be extremely fun. If you like good brain teaser and something to push you to the limits while scaring your socks off, the medium could be the right game for you. Well, thanks everyone. This is Evan. This has been Permission to Game. Tune in next time for another great episode as we walk through some really cool stuff. I got some uh, cool products coming up here I want to talk to you guys about and some upcoming games at the end of this month and moving into February, so definitely stay tuned, subscribe below, and I'll see you guys on another episode of Permission to Game. And as always, keep moving forward.